So I've heard different comments on um, the students' protest yesterday. Some thought that, you know, it was a good thing for the students coming out to, you know, because they are the victims in this whole um, scenario. Mm -hmm. Others said that, yes, it's good to strike, but you must be considerate of others. What are your general thoughts on this, uh, on their protest, especially blocking the international airport? And when the president was asked why international airport, we said this is the this is a corridor where those that are going out and coming in uh, 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 would, can be affected, and hopefully their voices can be heard. And some have said, well, there are other ways you can still strike and your voices will be heard. What are your thoughts on this? Do you think it was a good thing, and do you feel that um, there are plans to go to either Third Milan Bridge today or the uh, is there a proper ports today? They are, mm -hmm. I saw it in the papers that they are planning, they are threatening mm -hmm. to go further. What are your thoughts on this? I don't know, BC, you want to start on? Mariam. Okay, so okay. I, I think um, the Nigerian students are doing what they can do with the resources available to them. Uh, like you rightly mentioned at the beginning that uh, some persons have said that they are the victims of this. When two elephants are fighting, it's the grass that suffers, and they are the grass in this case. Because at the end of the day, ASU will resolve, federal governments will resolve, they will move back to class, they will probably earn all the money that they missed. The time now that the students have lost, nobody can Can't get it back. Get it back. Nobody. That time is gone. So I wouldn't blame the students, you know. And the other places that they have earmarked, that they're going to be uh, standing, they need to be paid attention to. Right. Unfortunately, it just seems like the government is taking its time to pay attention to them. It seems like ASU is not ready to relent in paying attention to these children. They, students, sorry, they need to be paid attention to. And for me, this just seems like the only way that they need to, that they are going to get that sort so of pay, attention. So paying attention to the, to the students really is calling off the strike, and that's yeah, what they that's want. It. Yeah. Now, but government will tell you, I've met them halfway. I have made some payments. I have, I have agreed to give them some amount of salaries. As you're saying, no, it's what we want or nothing. Mm. So these are two elephants that are fighting. What are your thoughts on this protest? And do you think that you could have gone about it a different way? Okay, so um, I think governments could have gone about it a different way. We learned how to strike from our colonial masters, the places that they are at now. Because presently, the president is in, the, <laughs> is in New York. The vice president United is Nations. in London. I wonder if the king was asking him, how would they do for our house? He would say, oh, correct. We are fine. We are not fine. Mm. Britain suffered an inflation recently. They are workers, real workers. Uh, dog workers. I was cuckoo there. Yeah. Yeah. Every workers. Yeah. You, oh, you were there. Yeah, you were there. Yeah. 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 What's five minutes delay? And they, and they responded. Mm. It means that the larger percentage of their population, their workforce, their greatest resource, human resource, if they scream, leadership would respond. But for here, who is that swaggy? They are used there. They, they are politicized. They, no, they haven't. When you meet them, Asu would know they've been met. Yeah. Asu would uh, compromise a strike, call it off, uh, while we are renegotiating inside the new MO. You have not met any, nobody is meeting anybody, anything. anything. Yeah. The same issues since forever That's years. Taro. The same issues. And we sort of watch our university system pause while we continue to do every other thing Absolutely. and uh, reduce the priority mm. to the barest, we, is the lowest in our, in our priority list. We met every other thing, even in this ASU strike. As ASU they strike, politics is going on. Mm, yes, N23 so. is in it's view. Coming. Money for elections is being released. Every other thing is in view. When the electricity workers shut down the other day, they answered them, they called them. Aviation people say they too, they will go to, they, they, immediately they summon them. So they are uh, responding to other things, but you see ASU, mm. it's the list of priorities. Mm. And so when ASU says that they've not met, and what we say they've not taken ASU seriously, mm. they haven't. The, the, the students blocking that road, what are your thoughts on the way they went about it? Because so, as I said, there are different arguments yeah. on how it went about. Yes. So for me, I feel it's so unfortunate that we have to allow students, I know they don't like to be referred to as children, children. but our children, because we're parents paying fees and everything, to have to go this route of standing on the road and protesting and looking for the next place that they feel will hit government the most. And the sad thing, and realistically, I'm looking at it, and I can say that I don't think that there's any place that these students will block that would affect government stance mm. or ASU stance. That's just the truth. Everything will work around them. The sort of the people that they think that they would want this to affect have a way of finding their way around things. They will find, they will, they will get on a helicopter and go where they need to go. Mm. They will find boats and get where they need to go. Security will make a path through the throng of people 
for, the peop for those caliber of people to pass through. So the truth is that I don't even know what these students can do to, to make government and ask to just sit down and say, you know what, this is enough.